what I'm going to start you on in a second is just some of the uh, disarms, uh, some of the uh, some of the puños, the throws, and uh, some of your stick lock. Okay, first one I, I want you to do is here as you speak to number one. Just a simple, okay, what we call a popcorn release. So you just sort of roll this in, and you dip. Just simple takedown, just loosen you up a little bit. So here, pulling your nose in the head. This takes goes to the leg. All right. So start off with that. Then we'll gradually get. I'll go from simple to hard, hard to simple. Who doesn't have sticks? We need sticks. We've got extra sticks. You guys need sticks? Okay. So we're going to take a three point entry. We're going to go slice one, two, three, four. You hit and back down. Okay. So just like you hit, you hit. Make it a little more combative. So four and you're in. Alright? So when the two comes, boom, you ride this. Mm. From here. Then you can get into business down with figure eight or whatever you want. So just start one, two, three, four. You're gonna get some. Alright? That's the next one. Contact um, the LA Academy. We work. We work to hit the hand. You hit the hand. You can. Uh, you can hit any other place on the body. So he's one of those drills that sort of gets you there. Now we have what we call uh, your Amaraz, which all they are just like your upward eight, up down here. And your multiple threads, multiple hitting and stuff. So we have 36 of those to teach, but they're very boring to teach. It's like shadow boxing. So I'm just going to go into the disarms and uh, some of your some of your eye jobs. Okay. Now this is a, what we call puño sombrada. I'm going to give you a little test on this. I'm going to take the disarms right here. So when he hits the three line, I block, I puño, I'm here, I'm back. One, two, three, four. Reality, see, this is hitting the head, so he has to come up and block it. This takes it down. So now see where the puño hits the hand, comes across, and I see a three. This is one version of it. Be down. Constantly shift the body. So you sort of get the, the foot work. What about that? That far. It's one, he takes the three line, I clean you he blocked that. Go to hit the head, he raises the stick up to check. Now, my left hand enters, I, I simulate hitting the head. See, this, this, this would end it right here. So, you don't want to hit here, smack. Okay, you take the disarm that way. Many, many disarms we're going to get into. So, when it comes, one, two, three, four, five, Six, he takes a turn, he pulls it down, right? I take the turn. I see where I'm constantly shifting the to the hip to the body. And to the right. Okay. Let's get this far. 
Now what we're going to do, we're going to take one turn here. One, two, okay, three. Now right from here to the first this arm. Throw. So right back into this. Good old step over Camelot. Okay. All right, so let's see the first one. So one, so I want you to pick it up. go here, see, I shoot this, I go directly into the throw. Mm. So you can hit, 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 insert, this way, step across and over, okay? I know, it's getting complicated. <laughs> so, that's your take now. If you don't want to throw, just take it. this motion here. Right. See, there's so much involved in this. You go into counter for counter, you see, with the grappling. So I don't want to take it too far where you get nothing out of the so we'll just What we we'll do instead of the throwing, I'm just going to take the just this arm. Then we'll change, change it. You want to hit? If I pull it down. This goes. This goes. This hits down. Mm. This see, you just bring the stick around. We hook it over. See what I'm? Then I change it right here. Okay. Let's do it a little bit more. Then we'll go to the next this one. Go here. One, two, three, four, five. Now when he's here, you shoot it, okay? And this throw goes straight down. I'm not 
I'm not going to go down. I just want you to just be careful with this across the throat, okay? And, uh, turn your head. Don't, when anyone ever goes to put a choke, always turn. Don't give them your larynx. Keep giving this in here. So I go here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now see what I said? See, I can, now see when I grasp the thumb, we work against the thumb. See, now this, this, this can come. I can go to this insert, but you just bring it. This is all you need. Boom. Now this disarm, you leave this thing here. Let's see. Right across, right? Okay, I'm sorry. Right here. See where you go? Press against the throat. You can even mount. See, you got all that pressure, see? All right? <clears throat> but we'll just take it apart. I just want to show you that that's your finishing product. So you leave it on that way. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Right from here, from you. Wing, heel drop. See, the other throw is here. You can take the stick, go right back into this. Okay? So you have a thumb lock throw, and you have the, this, the, uh, the outer one throw the thumb, uh, uh, the arm bar throws the hip, the throat, okay? So one more time, one, two, three, four, five. Now see, you, know, you sell this out, this hits and goes. Or if your stick is out here, smash, smash and it goes. All right, let's give it a go. Give me two minutes on this. Now the next one, boom, you strike the back of the, you, you hit between the back of the stick, you whack this, then you, you take it this way, you right back to the same sort of, right back to all these, okay? So see what I did, uh, just a little bit different, one, two, three, four, five. Boom. Whack. See, I just said, boom. Whack. Now see the thumb, the thumb lock here. You just take them down. Smash, smash, smash. Then insert and over. Okay? Right. Short, that's three. Three out of twenty two bones. <laughs>
so far, right? Okay. On the last one we just did, when I hit here, as soon as it, boom, see where that hits? You just spin it out, just steps in here. See? Now you have the neck lock, see, right here, then you can just strip it, get it working. Now see how I hold the hand to work against the thumb, okay? That's the secret. Okay, please don't demonstrate the, uh, the side. A bear hug with the stick. He strips it. Now see how he, he takes it out here? Now when you get this one, you want to get a hand in here. Remember the throw yesterday? <laughs> this is your counter to that too. You know the throw? So I took him over backwards, but I'm going to take him over. So I just want you to make sure you get one hand in and serve you for the count. See, all, all these just are counter for counter for counter. That's when it becomes fun, see. If you provide it, you're quick enough, okay? Sometimes you get the bear, sometimes the bear gets you. See, boom. Okay. Ah, see. So I feel this. So this, 
this is very painful across the kidney, see. So you want this in here. Hmm? See, now, now we're in what Dumas, the grappling thing. It usually will break the stick or boom, see, you can counter here. All kind of little nasty things you can do. Roll it. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take you into uh, this single stick. We're going, this is called a high ride or high switch. So you feed you one. You take it here. Now I want you to take this one. Now you go into the thumb squeeze. You take down right here. See where I, where, where I go here? Right. Get you to go down just a little bit. I don't, I don't force you. This, where, this comes in. We just you know, sit where you want your dog. I'm probably walking the dog. But you really squeeze that thumb. What you're doing, you're doing a high switch, we go single. See, smash. Here, now see where you capture the thumb. I've about got mine <laughs> right now. You just roll this board to take him down. And I'm gonna go real easy now. Just hold on piece, but I won't When I go here, this one you start to walk in control in this one. <coughs> see where it goes? Alright? I really love this one. I gave a gave an exhibition and at a Kung Fu championship in uh, Sydney, Australia, maybe. <laughs> I really like that one. <laughs> it's all So this one is a. <clears throat> so this is just what we call a thumb squeeze. You help this, see, protect the head. First strike, second strike. Now you roll this. Now I'm going to release this thumb a little bit just to keep it there. Boom. Now when you, you just keep walking, so I'm not putting enough pressure. So if you really do put pressure, it's really bad, okay? All right, let's give it a go. That's your first one. <laughs> All right, sure. Sure. What I'm doing, I'm giving you two things. Uh, see, each time walk through the uh, log flow, you might not get all the counters, but you at least have the, you know, ten locks with the uh, silver stone single stick. So one, see two, see three, see four, see five. See this. So one thing, when it goes to the five, it's pretty dangerous to pull because they can rip it back on your neck to the takedown. So it goes here. So you want to insert this. See where I'm at? See, see where it is? And this can, you know. All right. So make sure you get at least one hand on number five. Okay, ready to count? One, two, three, four, five. Get this hand in. See what I mean? Here. Now what this does, okay? So once more. Take two 
which one? Okay, which one is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. One thing on this all play sense is don't turn your throat into the speech. Turn your throat in. See where I go to counter this? the other piece, that's one Nelson. Okay, now he goes to the other Nelson. It's his. Okay, you just put it. All right? So work on both of those. Here, all you do is different moves to relieve it. Okay. Okay. Let go of it very quickly. You can't risk the perseverance you hung on. So when you're here, this is your next one. We takes it. You just now see, see this when I cross the arm, it goes here. You just continue to wind it. You get some. Wine till you find something. Here. I like to cross the try to cross the hand so you can break it. Cross the hand so you get something. All right. Go ahead. Keep working. Twist it away that way. You just, just want to get uh, where you get a what I call a lever or a brace where you take it away. So <coughs> when it goes down, one, I see two. You just cross the hand. Right. Work it a little bit more, and then we'll go to the last one. And we'll go to the last one. Nine is just this. Remember the old hand cross. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So that's simple enough. Once it goes here, you just shove it. You just put this on here. Okay. So the next one, when it goes to this, when it comes here, just insert it. See. So what you're physically, you feel through it's going here. So you just take it, see. All right. Okay. All right, so this is the last one. 
that too. So one. Number 10 is what he called a, uh, a web saw from your head. So if you, you take it one way, if you just push down, and you have this, this here. So usually I'll go on to three figure four. Before any lock goes. Now, if it releases it, just make this. Okay? Alright, just a little bit more, and then we'll change subject. Uh, play with it, and you'll find it. Uh, you'll find it this way. Remember, uh, one of the keys is work against the thumb to strip the stick out. Okay? Also, in locking your braces and whatnot. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to um, single stick this up. Go ahead and uh, do for me. Play more. See this 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 type of stick fighter. See you gonna have to see. It can be very it takes a good man, right? This is to rush in and, and uh, go through that. The guy's really but you won't time it, but eventually you'll get tired. It starts to slow up. That's when you can crash and this one. But this don't go rushing in against a good stick fighter because you're gonna get it. So, especially if it's good for your turn it to the Kuno. If they have strikes like these, or see here, it can be very deadly. Okay. So I guess the Danny Osanto I won't go attacking this. <laughs> All right. Um, so what we're going to do? We're going to say that you got there that the stick came one. If he swings, or maybe you rush in, you want to strip here and kick. All right. So your first one, I want you to pass it. Just hoop at it. Protect the head. Now see how I protect my head? Here, see, this, boom, see, this usually, usually is your, is your break. Now, so you strip it here. Okay. See, the takedown, you can see the footstep. Everything is programmed to go. All right. So, when this comes, protect the head, break, take it. Here, see. Right there. Uh, to, you go right in that pipe door here. I'm ready for that one. Uh -oh. <laughs> there you go. Okay. <laughs> so that'll be your first one. So protect the head. One, two. Strip. Walk him this way. Now when you turn, Same floor I went into. This is usually good enough. This is all as far as you have to take. All right, it's yours. Be careful with the mirror from this, this one here. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm going to show you um, before I close it up. We'll just take this one this time. Do what? Okay, now I can strip here. I can strip here. I can strip here, here. If I got a strong enough here, I can even strip it on this. Okay? So these are the different ways you can strip if you have a good grasp on the thumb. So this one comes one, two. One, two, three, four, five, two, six. Okay? Let's um, structure those strips a little bit. 
second strike. This is number two when he just comes to the upper side. Boom. This is what I want you to do. So as soon as you catch it, you want to mouse the elbow and come and strike. Okay. All right. Watch that. As it comes, elbow, the elbow right here, the break. So then you just drop it down and have it. So one is right here. So again, take this way. All right? Now I want to say sometimes, sometimes they like to hit. They can trap and back four. The eye in and back. Okay, sure. Any people have any, any of our sticks? Uh, Especially uh, his sticks. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, so you guys can see the, the relationship between the uh, grappling and the uh, boom lock with the stick, the locking. So you have uh, you know ten, a ten point lock flow. Any of those uh, locks, um, like on the wedge, you also have to okay. This can be done empty handed also. First, right? Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Seventh. So you can't get them all, but you basically do the same ones so with the empty hand the same lock while you did. So you get eight to ten. Uh, each one of those uh, locks is also a throw, but you can figure out the throw. Okay, you've been a very good group, Alan. Thank you very much. I have some uh, certificates. Uh, I want to thank David for having me and thank Pete for, for uh, taking the phone. Thank you. 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 Andrew Wayne. Andrew Tapper. Thank you very much. 
Neil Hoxton. Thank you. John Kim. Thank you. Peter Owens. Nigel Clue. Thank you. Sean Triner. Jonathan. Paul Baskerfield. Paul Adams. Ian Bridge. Mark Feeney. Jason Boldstone. Chris Hunt. Mark Cottrell. Brian Evans. Andrew Sargent. Ken Bolton. Mike Gray. Thank you very much.
Next thing they should do is put something in sector two. Okay, so if you put your seat in you sector two right now, boom, this is sector two as well. <coughs> you're carrying sector one to be self defense, boom, so I hit straight away to sector two. So I'm not moving sector two. Sector one, sector one, so I'm moving in sector two. Because if you do that, when you get to here and you fire that, and you, and nothing's happening, you haven't hit him. Okay, so as soon as I can, I hit tenderize before I move in. So now I'm making the way. See you over here? So I go here, see? I'm going to make the way. And you're the director, he's the directee. In order to do that, my hands have to make the way. In order to make the way, I have to hit him. Because he keeps the going. See, so when he comes in, I hit. <coughs> One step outside. Same thing. Okay, can you take it up off? Oh, good. 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 So what I'm trying to say is that's what you're doing. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. 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 Just the elbow joint. 
Yeah. 